Hello guys, welcome to the news. The presidential candidate of the Labour Party and the former governor of Anambra State, Peter Greg Obi, has revealed what must happen before he drops his presidential ambition in the Federal Republic of Nigeria. The presidential candidate of the Labour Party, LP, during the 2023 general election, which took place on the 25th of February 2023, Peter Greg Obi has revealed that he will drop his presidential ambition if the Federal Republic of Nigeria is working. Speaking in an interview witnessed by Channels Television and Television Continental TVC News, Peter Greg Obi, the former governor of Anambra State, said he mustn't, be, he mustn't be president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria if Nigeria is working. This is said while responding to a question asking about his 2027 political ambition. Zagreb Obi added that all he wants is a country where the untold hardship faced by Nigerians is ended. Meanwhile, yesterday, Lamidi Apapa faction of the Labour Party urged Peter Greg Obi and his counterparts from the People's Democratic Party, PDP, who is also the former Vice President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, under the regime of Olusha Gomba Sonjo and Haji Atiku Abubaka, to emulate the gesture of the President of Liberia, Jojui, and congratulate the President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, in person of Ashua Jubala Ahmed Tunubu. But the presidential candidate of the Labour Party, Peter Gregory Obi, who is also the former governor of Anambra State, has revealed what must happen in the Federal Republic of Nigeria before he drops his ambition for the office of the president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. He also said, he also said, revealed that he will drop his presidential ambition if the Federal Republic of Nigeria is working. He was speaking with reporters. He said he must not be the president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria if Nigeria is working perfectly and if the untold hardship faced by citizens of the Federal Republic of Nigeria all ended, then he doesn't want to be the president of the country. He said while responding to the question asking about his 2027 political ambition, we recall that the media papa faction of the Labour Party has urged its presidential candidates Peter Gregory Obi and the People's Democratic Party PDP presidential candidate in person of Alaji Atiku Abubakar to emulate the gesture of the president of Liberia, George Wee, and congratulate President Ashua Jubola Metinumbu as the president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. Peter Gregory Ongbuasi Obi, who is a Nigerian politician, businessman, and philanthropist, who served as governor from March, 2000, March to November 2006, February to May 2007, and July 2007 to March 2014. Peter Gregory Obi was born in Onicha in 1961. Peter Obi graduated from the University of Nigeria in Suka in 1984. Afterwards, he entered business and banking, eventually holding several executive positions in several banks. Peter Gregory will be contested for the governor in 2003 as a member of the All Progressive Grand Alliance, but Chris Igige was declared winner of the election. In 2006, the election of Chris Igige was nullified and Peter Gregory Obi was declared winner of the 2003 election and he assumed office in March 2006. Shortly, he was impeached in, the November, in November the same year by the Anambra State House of Assembly led by Honorable Michael Mike Balungu. However, his impeachment was overturned as he returned to office in February 2007. Peter Obi was removed after the 2007 Anambra State gubernatorial election, but the judiciary again intervened by, the, by ruling that he should be allowed to complete a full four-year term. In 2010, he was re-elected to a second term. After leaving office in 2014, Peter Obi decamped to the People Democratic Party. In 2019, he was selected as the People Democratic Party PDP vice presidential nominee in the presidential election running alongside Alhaji Atiku Abubakar, 
but he lost to the tic- he lost the ticket to the incumbent president Muhammad Buhari and vice president Yemi Osibajo. In 2022, Peter Gregory Obi ran for president himself, first in the People's Democratic Party, PDP, until defecting to the Labour Party, LP, in May 2022 to obtain its nomination. Peter Gregory Obi presidential campaign has been described as populist and has been noted for its support among many young Nigerians who has been nicknamed the Obedient. Peter Greg Obi was a businessman before he ventured into politics. He held leadership position in some, some private establishments. Some of the companies he served include Next International Nigeria Limited, Chairman and Director of Guardian Express Mortgage Bank Limited, Guardian Express Bank PLC, Future V Security Limited, Paymaster Nigeria Limited, Charms Nigeria Limited, Data Corps Limited, and Card Center Limited. It was the youngest chairman of Fidelity Bank PLC. On the 24th of March 2022, Peter Gregory Ubi declared his intention to run for the president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria under the platform of the People's Democratic Party. But he later pulled out and announced he would be running under the Labour Party platform instead. Peter Gregory Ubi wrote to the leadership of the People's Democratic Party PDP on the 24th of May 2022 to resign his membership. Peter Obi reportedly complained of massive bribing of delegates and vote buying at party, pres- at party presidential primary, citing the exist- existence of a plastic clinic collaborating against him. Peter Greg Obi, business background and status as a major candidate not affiliated with either of the Nigerian two main parties has drawn comparison with Emmanuel Macron's successful 2017 French presidential candidacy. Peter Gregory Obi has expressed admiration for Macron and was among the officials who received Macron during his visit to Lagos State. Younger generation under 30 proved to be some of the biggest Peter Gregory Obi supporters, showing their supporters support via social media and protests and street marches. Aisha Yusuf, a prominent activist noted as the co-founder of the Bring Back Our Girls movement and, the, and a supporter of the NSAS campaign, endorsed Peter Gregory Obi in her first ever endorsement of a presidential candidate in the Federal Republic of Nigeria. That will be all for now. Please don't forget to click on the like and subscribe button. And let us know your thoughts and your opinion via the comment section below. And I will see you on the next news. Bye for now.